Hey there guys, what's going on and welcome back to our channel. Humans may be near the top of the food chain right now, but who are our ancestors' most giant predators? There are many animals who love eating without even being hungry. But leopards and tigers hit all the list of deadliest animals. So let's talk about the 10 deadliest animals in history. Number 10, Leopard of Gamalapur. Leopard of Gamalapur in the mid 20th century claimed 42 victims in southwestern India. It's also known as the Spotted Devil of Gamalapur. The leopard terrorized the villages of Gamalapur and Devra Beta. When residents took to barricading their doors at night, it forced its way in through thatch walls. Eventually, the Indian-born British hunter and writer Kenneth Anderson managed to hunt it down and discovered porcupine quills on its right forefoot, preventing it from pursuing faster prey. <laughs> Number 9. Tigers of Chowgar Man-eaters don't always hunt alone. Known as the Tigers of Chowgar, this Bengal tigress and her sub-adult cub reportedly killed 64 people in the Kuman region of Uttarakhand in northern India. The true number of victims may be higher. It includes victims who were mauled and died afterwards. In 1929, famed British hunter and naturalist Jim Corbett was asked to hunt the man-eaters down. It took him several attempts but Corbett eventually shot and killed both tigers. He discovered that the tigress had a broken canine, worn down teeth, and broken claws, explaining her unusual change in diet. <laughs> Number 8. Leopard of Golis Range Lil is known about this man-eater who roamed the Golis Mountains in northwestern Somalia in the late 1800s. British big game hunter H.G.C. Swain wrote that according to locals, it claimed more than 100 victims. A panther with dark fur that blended into the shadows would lie in wait on rocks that overlooked a turn in the path, ambushing its prey from above. The region's rough terrain made leopards difficult to track, and this man-eater's final faith is unknown. According to English traveler James Forsythe, a panther in the Sony district of central India came close to the same victim count. The Sony panther was said to drink its victim's blood and leave the bodies. Number 7. The Beast of Javadon A long tough tail, russet fur, and a huge head full of teeth, what was the Beast of Javadon? This man-eater stalked the former French province of Gévaudan in the 1760s, killing an estimated 113 people. Based on descriptions, it's believed to have been a large wolf or wolf dog, but at the time, there were also fears that it was a witch or a werewolf. Other theories claimed it was a hyena lion or even a mastiff armored or boar hide. King Louis XVI sent in soldiers and hunters, but the deaths only stopped after farmer Jean Tastel shot a wolf-like creature with a silver bullet in 1767. A huge beast terrorized the population in an 80 km square area of southeastern France. Number 6. The Leopard of Rudra Prayag For eight years, the people of Godville in northern India lived in terror of the dark thanks to this relentless man-eater. The leopard of Rudra Prayak would catch victims outdoors at night, but that didn't mean locals were safe at home. The leopard would break down doors, enter through windows, and even dig through mud walls dragging people away into the dark. Official records put fatal attacks at 125. When soldiers failed to catch the leopard, Jim Corbett, the same hunter who killed the tigers of Chowgar embarked on a 10-week hunt in 1926 that brought the leopard's reign to an end. Corbett suspected that the leopard had gotten a taste for humans from scavenging on unburied bodies after an epidemic. <laughs> Number 5. Savo Man-Eaters This notorious pair of maneless lions have become legendary. In 1898, 
The duo terrorized workers building a railway bridge over Kenya's Savo River. They dragged victims right out from their tents and, for the better part of a year, defied all attempts to stop them, evading hunters and jumping over thorn fences placed around the campsite. Lieutenant Colonel John Henry Patterson, who oversaw construction, blamed them for 135 deaths, although subsequent studies have suggested that he may have exaggerated. After months of attacks, Peterson himself was able to shoot and kill them. <laughs> Number 4. Gustav A scarring living legend, Gustav. He haunts the Russian River and Lake Tanganyika in Burundi. He was estimated to be over 60 years old. The grizzled croc is thought to weigh a colossal 2,000 pounds. The exact number of his victims is unknown, but rumors claim he's responsible for a staggering 300. Of course, this could be exaggerated or the result of several animals, a common problem with reports of man-eaters. Either way, you probably wouldn't want to get in the water with him. Eluding capture and shrugging off bullet wounds, Gustav has attained near-mythic status. He was last sighted in 2015, so today, he may actually be more legend than living. When he was spotted early on, he was seen with a full set of teeth, meaning that he was still relatively young. Number 3. The Panner Man Eater In the 1900s, a prolific man-eater stalked the common hills in northern India, reportedly killing over 400 people. In 1910, Jim Corbett, who later hunt down the children tigers and the Rotra praying leopard, stepped in. Scouting the area, he came across a remote homestead where the leopard had dragged a sleeping woman from her bed. Her terrified husband had pulled her free, but the wounds in her throat and chest were septic. Corbett returned months later and this time succeeded in shooting the leopard as it charged by the light of burning torches dropped by his men as they bolted. One wild animal had killed more than a hundred people in the United States or Europe at the turn of the 20th century. Number 2. The Tigress of Champawat Jim Corbett heard about the pattern leopard while hunting an even more dangerous man-eater in 1907, the Tigress of Champawat. The tigress started killing in Nepal, evading hunters and even the Nepalese army, whose efforts drove her down into India's Kumon region. The killing continued, reaching an estimated 436, mostly women and children. The tigress of Champawat is one of the most dangerous hunters ever in history. This tigress can kill a person in one attack without even putting any sort of effort into it. Number 1. Lions of Jum The Savo man-eaters might be legendary, but they pale in comparison to the Lions of Jum. Between 1932 and 1947, this pride of 15 lions in southern Tanzania was responsible for some 1,500 deaths. They were cunning, traveling to villages under the cover of darkness and reportedly using a relay system to drag bodies back into the bush. The attacks followed the colonial government's decision to kill thousands of zebras, giraffes, and buffaloes to protect livestock from an outbreak of rinderpest. However, locals had another explanation. The lions were controlled by a witch doctor named Matamala Mangara, who had been dismissed as headman from the Iyahi village. Their reign of terror was finally brought to an end by the British game warden George Rushby and his scouts. So these were some of the most terrifying and dangerous animals of all time, and it was hard to save ourselves from their attacks during their time. Do shout out in the comments below whether you agree with our picks or not. Also, do yourself a favor and watch the two videos that are already on your screen right now as they're just as good as this one. And with that, I'll be seeing you guys in the next video.